Hi, my name is Miss Jan, and I work for the Irving Public Library. I'm so glad that you have chosen to join us today for our Aesop Fable Tellers segment. Aesop's fables are short stories that have been told and shared for many, many generations. Each fable illustrates a moral and teaches a lesson. We hope you will enjoy the fable that we have chosen to share with you today. The town mouse went to visit his cousin in the country. The country mouse loved the town mouse and heartily welcomed him. Wheat and corn were all he had to offer but he offered them freely. The town mouse turned up his nose at this offer and said, I cannot understand, cousin, how you can put up with such poor food as this. But of course, you cannot expect anything better in the country. Come with me and I will show you how to live. When you have been in town a week, you will wonder how you could have ever stood a country life. No sooner said than done. The two mice set off for the town and arrived at the town mouse's residence. You will want some refreshments after your long journey, said the polite town mouse, and he took his cousin into the grand dining room. There they found the remains of a fine feast and soon the two mice were eating up apples and grapes and cakes and all that was nice. Suddenly they heard loud voices. Who is that? said the country mouse. It is only the people of the house, answered the town mouse. Only, said the country mouse. I do not like the way they sound. Just at that moment, the door flew open. In came a man with a large broom to clean up, and the two mice had to scamper down the table and run off. Goodbye, cousin, said the country mouse. What? You're going so soon? said the town mouse. Yes, he replied. It's better to live life happily with a little than live in fear with a lot. And that is the moral of this story.